So Prince, I would like to ask you a question. If you have a sister that wants to get married, would you prefer her to marry a rich guy or would you prefer her to marry a guy that she will suffer with to make it in life? Uh, honestly, it depends. If my sister loves both, both the rich man and the one that is still struggling to make it in life, and she wants me to make a choice for her, uh, if my sister has something doing, I will, I will advise her to marry the one that is still struggling so that the both of them will grow together and value each other. Uh, but if my sister has no job or no career, okay. I will advise her to, I will even force her to marry the one that is rich because I won't want my sister to suffer. Okay. That is my answer. So what I'm, what I'll ask you now is that if you want to marry, if you have a girl that you truly, truly love mm. and then you want to marry the girl, then another man wants to marry the guy. And this man is very, very rich. When I say rich, I mean rich. Mm. And then the girl's brother is not telling her that he wants her to marry the rich guy. What will you do? Would you be happy that the girl is choosing a rich man over you? I will not be happy, but I will understand because if I find myself in her, in her brother's shoe, I will do the same. Yeah. I will not be happy. That is it, for sure. I'll be hot, but I'll understand. Uh, that is for sure. And th that is the more reason why I'm not yet married and still struggling to make it. Because as I am now, if I marry any woman that, that has no money, no career, uh, she will be a liability to me, to my growth. And so, but once I become rich, uh, I can provide for any gear that I fall in love with. Uh, your question, I like your question because I have girls. Okay. I don't want my uh, my daughter to marry. Let me just say a, a already made, okay. but I don't want him again to marry who she will suffer with. Let me just say a man that God has blessed. That is the man that have hand working or have something doing that went through he, what he's doing, mm. he, he will feed my, yeah. my daughter. Ah, yeah. This your question is a very nice one because I wanted to twist the question, but you <laughs> answer very yeah. nice because I thought you would say maybe already made man and I would no. say what if your son wants not, to will, marry and he's not I will rich. not say already made because some of already made now uh, is not is not like already made before. Yes. Okay. You understand me? Yes. Maybe yes. you you understand where I'm I'm heading to. Yes. So I want the one that God Himself will bless mm. both of them. Okay. Yeah. Chris, I would like to ask you: Would you prefer to marry already made uh, man or man to uh, the one that you will suffer with? Well, actually, I don't want like an already made guy, okay. and I don't want a guy that is very poor, like very poor. But I'll prefer a guy that I know is hard working, and I'm sure, with or without money, with what he knows and have his experience in different things, will be okay. With or without, with or without him being very rich before I marry him, okay. I think we can grow together and make the money. But you know there are some people that hustle so much, but yet the money will not, will come. not come. And some of them finally will end up using their wife for ritual. Have you not heard that some men use their wife for ritual? Yeah, that is why you marry a guy that is God-fearing. Because a guy that is God-fearing will not use you for money. No, you, you, no this one, I shut up. You give me another question again. <laughs> Thank you for your answer. <laughs>